Good morning. Oh, I fogged up. Good morning, everybody from the Disney Dream. I'm on our balcony right now, our little veranda, and it is castaway day. Oh my gosh, my camera's gonna be so foggy. My camera's so cold because like it was in the room all night, so like bringing it outside just gets all foggy. But this is, here we are. This is where we disembark. So, Shannon and I have stand-up paddle boarding this morning. I didn't bring my GoPro, so I'm not gonna be able to film like out on the water. But maybe if Allison and Laura come out with us, they can kind of get some footage of us like doing our stand-up paddle boarding. Uh, so we're all gonna disembark. It's about 8.30 right now. And our excursion is at 9.10. So we're all gonna disembark pretty shortly here and have ourselves a castaway day. It's a little overcast and the weather does call for rain, but we're hoping for the best. And I'm excited to just see how everything is. I haven't been to the island in three years, so I'm excited to see uh, what they're, what is different and uh, what kind of offerings they have. Um, it's our last day of our cruise, our last full day. Tomorrow we disembark, which is so sad. So we're gonna have ourselves a fun-filled day. As you can see, they serve you now at Cabana's. Our options are oatmeal, toast, pastries. And then we move over here. And we have grilled tomato, Mexican hot pocket, ham and cheese croissant, sausage, bacon, eggs. And then they have um, like little breakfast sandwiches over there. And that's it. That's the breakfast offering today. And yesterday and the day before. As you can see, Mickey waffles are missing. So here they have fruit, and here they have uh, oatmeal toppings, and then cereal and milk right at the end, and that's everything. So here they have coffee and juices, and then they have, you know, obviously the soft drinks, or where you get water, and then somebody serves you as well. So here's what I got for a quick breakfast before the island, hash brown, fruit, got some peanut butter from Laura, and then a nice little view of the island. So it's 9.24, we just got off the ship. We had our little breakfast at Cabana's. Look at this shot, oh my god, the cruise ship behind me, look. Cute, I know. Oh look, it's Jack Sparrow. Yak Sparrow. <laughs> yak. <laughs> there was Yak Sparrow. Anyway, we're gonna go, we're four minutes late to our excursion, so we are walking over to the little beach where we're gonna do our stand-up paddle boarding. And the girls stayed on board. They're gonna meet us at Serenity Bay, the adults-only beach. Thanks guys. You're welcome. Wave your hands like this. Okay, you. Me and Shannon went paddle boarding. The South African lifeguards loved me. Ate us up, me and Shannon. And we were not worried at all if they were gonna save us. Yeah, we were not. And um, we bullied one of them into coming out to sea to take our photos. <laughs> and um, then it started thunderstorming. You can probably hear it. You can probably hear it. It's not raining yet, but we can see like the lightning and the thunder. So we are, we don't know what we're gonna do yet. We're gonna walk into this little shop, see if they have anything. And then we're, we might go back to the ship because it looks like it's about to pour. There's a 60% chance of rain, but paddle boarding was literally so fun. If you have the opportunity to do it, definitely do it. It was a really good time. I've never done paddle boarding on Castaway and like the view of the ship is so beautiful. You see, you're like right next to the ship. I'm sure you can see in the pictures. So. I'd highly recommend. We're on a very bumpy tram. <laughs> on a, onward to Serenity Bay! <laughs> Woo so we just ran into one of my, um... This feels so right. <laughs> we just ran into one of my old co-workers and he was like, hey, 
hey and I was like do you remember me well he said hey how like it's been a while how have you been and I'm like do you remember me and he was like yeah of course do I remember you he's like you're just skinny now and I was like <laughs> <laughs> okay <laughs> look at all the families are riding the bike down the airstrip we are living serenity baby baby we found the okay, girl. If, we, if we um win the lottery we'll charter the Disney <laughs> You'd have to win a big A lottery. And then we <laughs> Okay, so here's the food we got from Serenity Bay BBQ. It is a little different than previous. There's no mahi mahi. It is now salmon, but the salmon looks absolutely banging. Fire. It's very good. They have vegetarian chili, which is new and looks very good. They have this, what is this, corn salad? Mm -hmm. Has avocado, black beans, tomato, looks very good. I got potato salad, which has been there forever, mango, and I got some cornbread. Oh my God, I Shannon cornbread. went ahead and got a burger and basically no all the same things as me. They do have a toppings bar now with some like tzatziki and things, but everything is served for you at the Serenity Bay BBQ. So one of the differences at Serenity Bay BBQ is that they serve you here. So you, it's not as easy to do food hacks like a Big Island cookie ice cream sandwich because you're gonna have to ask somebody to oh, put ice cream on your cookie. Food hacks. Guys, I have a big crunch on that lifeguard. <laughs> like a real big crunch. The one with the mullet and the nose ring. He was so hot. I'm in love. I always fall in love on a Disney cruise. Remember that guy at the Cove Cafe in New York? Yeah. He was so beautiful. Yeah. And I was like, he made me an espresso and I fell in love. <laughs> Serenity Bay, but the weather looks like it's improving, so we're gonna go to do some shopping, and then we're gonna see, uh, see what there is to see. So the island workers closed the beaches for like, it's been what, maybe like an hour and a half? maybe two hours while we had our lunch. Everything's been closed. So we took our tram back to the family beach and from Serenity Bay and we ate over by the Serenity Bay BBQ and now it is 1240. The sun is out so we came back to the family beach um, from Serenity Bay because we were about to leave but it's a, turning out to be a beautiful day which me and Shannon knew would happen. Yeah, because we've seen our first rodeo. Seen our first rodeo. Uh, no hammocks. Right now in Castaway, my mom would be upset, but there's plenty of chairs, there's tons of space, tons of empty space, and the beaches are open again, so we're gonna go do some swimming. <laughs> Sing it, Shannon. No. So we finally got a seat. <laughs> at the family beach because <laughs> we're family and now all of a sudden i have miraculously started a period <laughs> right now where i'm sitting <laughs> i don't know if this is ever going to make it into the vlog but <laughs> i mean really just my luck <laughs> so we left castaway it's about three o'clock it was gearing up to storm again but it honestly it's held off it still looks pretty nice, but I'm not feeling my best right now, so we are gonna go to the Cove Cafe. And I, I'm like so typical, but I just really do want some like chocolatey treats. So I think I'm gonna get like a cupcake, because they're free. Okay, so these are all the offerings they have. They used to change every day, but they haven't changed since I've been here. So this is the chocolate pillow Danish. I got this, and I got the orange chocolate cupcake, which I didn't really enjoy very much. Um, but I think I'm, today I'm going to get the caramel tartlet and the chocolate pillow in it. And then we just ordered pumpkin spice lattes. I nixed the kombucha idea. I think this will be better. You really haven't eaten as much as like, I thought you would. Caramel tartlet, chocolate pillow danish, rice krispie. Every day our mugs are different and they are just so cute. Drinking a PSL in your swimsuit. <laughs> Autumnal. 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 
and people go. Hey, so we're still on at Castaway Day here. It is 4.42. We haven't sailed away from Castaway yet. We're still on the island. And Shannon and I are taking a stroll around deck four. I just finished my book. I was reading Kisses and Croissants. It was awful, don't recommend it. I just finished my book, We Are the Brennans, and I gave it four stars. I highly recommend it. You could follow us on Goodreads. I'll link us down below. <laughs> Attention, this is your master of ceremony with a special announcement. We hope everyone enjoyed Castaway Key. And while you were enjoying the sun and fun, a few of the island's ghostly inhabitants may have come aboard. You see, spirits are frankly sensitive to bright light. So, before we depart, all spirits ashore who are going ashore. I'm sure they wouldn't want to leave any body behind. <laughs> Night three, our final night is underway. We just spent some time in the room getting ready. It's been a very chill castaway day. This is the last night's look. Shannon, would you like to join me? Yeah, I'm here. These you guys need to be the judge, but like, do you think I look like a Sunday school teacher? Shannon thinks she looks like a Sunday school teacher. I think I look like Sharpay Evans in her performance of Huma Huma Nuka Nuka, which is kind of what I was going for, TBH. Um, <laughs> but we're gonna go find a spot to take some pictures of our last look. And then we're gonna go to Pub 687 to get a drink. It's 619 and dinner is not till eight, so. We're just gonna do some roaming. This trip has been like very chill. I feel like with COVID changes, there are not like endless activities. Like I feel like when we were in Alaska on our trip, we were never bored. We were running from like activity to activity. And this trip, I don't know if it's cause we're older and like we just wanna like read and lay, <laughs> but like- It's increased, you know, since Alaska. Cause that was like our first foray into like the relaxing type of cruises. I agree with that. Like we used to be like, oh, trivia. We sat in trivia for five minutes and we were like, gotta get out of here, <laughs> which we used to love. So things are just changing a little bit for oh, us. But did we talk about, or did you talk about Jordan Caswell? No, I haven't. Oh, okay, well, I was told by my manager that I needed to see the Taylor Swift show by this violinist called Jordan Caswell, but we've been calling him Jordan Cahill, like from um, a la Stuck in the Suburbs. Stuck in the suburbs. So we went to it last night and that man is so talented. He literally was like, okay, everyone, like let's vote on our favorite Taylor Swift album. So me and Jana were like screaming for Speak Now. Duh. And then he played, what did he play first? Oh, he played Speak, Speak Now, now. Song, which is fine. But like, like he said, okay, okay I'm gonna like, stay on yeah. Speak Now for a minute. And we were right in the front, so like I could hear him talking, he could hear me talking, and at the same time we both said Enchanted. And it was so beautiful. And he played Wildest Dreams, and it was just like it was a great time. It was the set so was much fun. The set was so good, and it was like the whole audience was a bunch of Taylor Swift fans. Everybody was but we singing. We were the most like vocal. We're always the most vocal. We always are just carrying <laughs> this ship with our excitement, like literally always. Um, and when we didn't know the words, like, Laura carried us through. This is true. It was a lot of fun, and so... It was and, honestly a highlight for me. And I didn't think that I, that I, I wouldn't have thought to go to a violinist thing, so... Yeah, but we thank my manager. This is true. Thanks, manager. <laughs> Okay, so we went to the Skyline Lounge and it is not open post-COVID. It's only a room for seminars right now, like drinking seminars. 
and it's not open. So then we went to Meridian Bar upstairs by Paolo, and we like were getting service. So we went ahead and went to King because nothing else was working out. And I got the pomegranate passion fruit, and Shannon got the elder bubble, so I'll let you know how those are. But our dinner's in 20 minutes, so we're just gonna try to get it out. this shit on our back. No, we keep it afloat. Literally, everybody's obsessed with us. <laughs> Nobody's having any fun if we're not there. Yeah. We bring the fun. We should so there was it. a kind of proposal situation. You could, I would not call it that. But one could <laughs> call it that. <laughs> but me thinks. <laughs> it was one. I it didn't hear the word Mary. I or didn't hear me. I do. Wait, I didn't you see a ring. Oh, Note to our future husband. Yeah, like just a heads up. If I'm wearing a mask and you're wearing a mask, don't. <laughs> 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 like, we're taking Allison up into the funnel. You got to be quieter on the teens, otherwise they'll call you grandpa. <laughs> we're on our way up to tour the spot. We're. Buddy Velastro of The Cake Boss. <laughs> God dang. Can we just try to open it? Yeah. Yeah. Can you listen at the door? <laughs> there are, you're allowed to be in here. We could just look. Cool. This is Jeff where he got married. This is where Ew. allegedly Buddy The Cake Boss Got married. That's Buddy, tacky. The cake. I think it was his vow renewal. His oh. wife Lisa. I met him at test track. 
freezing. Laura, show us what so we got good. for our it's towel so animal. Cold. We got a chicken. No, I think it's supposed to be a monkey, but it kind of looks like a turkey. <laughs> yeah. It looks like a Thanksgiving turkey. Turkey, yeah, monkey. Does. It looks like a Thanksgiving turkey going like this. <laughs> Ow. Yeah. You guys, SOS. night three. SOS. Is Night done so. Was so fun. We did it. It all yeah. happened, and the cruise is over. Wow. No. Cry. We're very sad. It went by super quickly. These three night cruises. <laughs> Shannon's in her depression bed. Three night cruises go by <laughs> too quickly. <laughs> but I thank you guys for watching okay. my video. We're gonna be cruising again before Christmas. Woo! So make sure you check out that video. We gotta be quiet for the girl next to us who doesn't know what buffalo <laughs> mozzarella oh, is. Yeah. I forgot. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Happy Just G Tuesday. Bye.